The current heat wave in Greater Lafayette can be challenging for people without adequate shelter. News 18's Perry Apostolakos is live now to tell us more about the resources a local organization is offering during times like these. Hey Perry. Hey there, Joe and Samantha. I'm here in Lafayette, outside of Lafayette Urban Ministry, where I spoke to some folks about the challenges that people experiencing homelessness can face, whether in extreme weather or not. It didn't matter if it was hot or cold. It was always a bad experience to be out, you know, in, uh, in the elements with nowhere to go. The recent heat waves hitting Greater Lafayette can pose difficulties for many. But for those experiencing homelessness, the hot weather can be harder to manage. That's why Lafayette Urban Ministry has a cooling center in their Lafayette office lobby, open to anyone who wants to cool off and get something to drink. There is also an air-conditioned 44-bed emergency shelter open 9 p.m. to 7 a.m. It has been at full capacity for a while now. We have had to turn some people away, men in particular. We still have a few spaces for women. There's definitely a correlation between extreme weather and the services we provide because if you don't have adequate shelter, uh, you need a place to get in away from extreme heat. And most people didn't want you, you know, in their environment. Patrick Renfro is a teacher at Lum's after school program. He experienced homelessness over four years ago. And you had people with health issues, a lot of older people, this homeless. Renfro estimates about 200 people in the Lafayette area are unsheltered each night. Spending long amounts of time in excessive heat can lead to heat illness, which can result in multi-system organ dysfunction and even death if untreated. And for their long-term health, long-term safety, these kind of services are absolutely essential. But being unhoused can also have a negative impact on one's mental health. Everybody wants to be wanted. They, they might say, you know, they don't care, you know, uh, but, but that's not true. Everybody wants to be wanted by somebody and some, you know, and, 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 and be accepted, you know. And so for, for a person to not to be accepted and to not to be wanted, it could do something to your self-esteem. Tillett says although they may not always have space for everyone who needs it, LUM can connect with community partners and find people a place to stay out of the heat. Reporting live in Lafayette, Perry Apostolakos, News 18.